All right, Hot Squad, what is happening? So, after a week of reactions, I get a chance to do last week. Finally, back with new reactions. So, we're going to do it this different. I'm going to do this different, my scheduling. Instead of just doing Wednesday, Thursday, and Saturdays, I'm going to do it any any single day and every week. Because, you know, with my scheduling being a little conflicted and I'm back in college, you know, it's interfering my reactions. I have work and I get so damn tired. I want to get a chance to do reactions any day, any week. So, you know what? I'm going to do that starting this week. So, Hot Squad, let's get straight to it. Yes, ABC just dropped the 95th Academy Award nominations this morning. And I'm finally getting a chance to see it. So, I'm very excited for this. I hope we I see some... Legit nominations, y'all. Legit nominations. I know there's going to be some big surprises and big snubs. So, well, Fruit Hot Squad, let's jump right into it. The 95th Academy Award nominations. Let's check it out, see if it's legit. Right? Right. Things are going to get crazy. And now, our feature presentation. And now, to present the nominees, here are today's hosts. 2022 Oscar winner Liz Ahmed and the star and executive producer of the movie, Alice Megan was a great movie, by the way. I saw it when it first came out. Great movie. I recommend seeing that. Alrighty, let's get it. Not surprising. I'm not seeing Black Panther too, but her performance is really good as the Queen Ramonda. Okay, I've not seen the whale. Hmm. Haven't seen that one yet. Nice. Nice. Also, by the way, I know I'm going to you know, keep on pausing this and that, but this is actually the first nomination, Jamie Lee Curtis, over 40 plus years in her career, her first Oscar nomination. Hell yes. So glad to see she actually got an Oscar nod. All right. Nice. Also, by the way, recommend seeing everything ever at once. I just saw it on Showtime a week ago. Fantastic movie. My second favorite movie of the year after Taco Maver, obviously. But yes, incredible movie. Recommend seeing that, and if you don't, have not seen everything everywhere, Stephanie Shu plays Michelle Yeoh's daughter. So, yeah. Okay. Not seen that. Okay, not surprising. Okay, yeah, yeah. Elvis has some pretty good costume design. Yeah. Hell yeah. Mrs. Harris goes to Paris. Mm. 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 Mm.
Mm, okay. I heard about this movie. Okay. Heard really good things about this movie. I know it's on Netflix. Yeah, I was just that. Yes, Batman made the cut. Hell yes. Elvis. Okay, yeah, Elvis. Yep. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. I heard Babylon think what they want to go and go. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. Wait a minute. It's okay. Oh, okay. 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 I think the first one got the um not so living. <coughs> what? Wow. What? Okay, that I did not expect it because I haven't seen a bunch of um, award ceremonies gotten Top Gun Maverick as best that screenplay. Now, that's a surprise. That's the biggest surprise. Wow, dude. And the screenplay was really freaking good. Really love the writing in the movie. Like, wow, okay. All right, Top Gun. Mm. Okay. I heard about this movie. Okay. Oh, what's mm -hmm. yep, yep, yep. Mm -hmm. I heard about this movie. It's hard. Mm. I heard about this movie. I don't really care about this category, honestly. An Irish goodbye. No one care about Zero. Hmm. <laughs> really? <laughs> that really is hard. Everybody's laughing at. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> wow, what a title! That's hell, that's some hell of a title. What the hell? That's some titles, man. Oh boy. <laughs> hmm. Yep. I heard that. You know, was gonna be in it. Oh wow, Paperboy. All right, okay, Paperboy. That hurts. Okay, cool. And okay, good. He made the cut. Obviously, he made the cut. This is his win, regardless. Hmm. <laughs> 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 
Nice, nice. Also, by the way, um, Universal has just greenlit a Megan sequel, which I'm excited for. So, I'm gonna skip through this real quick. I want to do it like this style. Instead, of just like downloading the entire video, I want to do the record from my PC screen be easier because it's gonna take freaking minutes to download it. So, I don't want that to happen. Oh, right, hold on. Okay, bear with me, y'all. Bear with me. There we go. All right. Okay, let's go. Okay, I never heard this movie. Not surprising. That's a banger. Hold my hands, a banger. Lift me up. Mm hmm. That's a banger, too. Mm -hmm. Wow. Uh, which, by the way, for Lift Me Up, this is the first Oscar nomination for Rihanna. So, congrats to Rihanna. And not to not to, I think it did win Best Original um, Song as well. So, it might get this category for sure. And this is like that's a really good song to me, everything everywhere. So, pretty good choices here. Don't care about this category. Okay, I know. I kind of feel like it's gonna get that. I heard about that in the Golden Globes. No, I think I heard this movie. Hmm. Okay. Cool. Oh. Alrighty. Oh, for um the incident, the last category. Um, I heard a lot of people are very pissed off. About decision leaving, or, or didn't get the nod, didn't get made the cut. So, yeah, a lot of people are pissed off about that. I need to see that. Need to see that. Need to see that. Need to see that. Yep, turn red. I know it's gonna make the cut. Turn red. Great movie, actually. Great movie. Okay. Okay. All quiet is sweeping the category so far. Batman, yes. Finally, yes. Getting some love. Okay, Black Panther. Yep. Mhm. Mm Elvis, yeah. The whale. Okay. Hmm. <coughs> hey man, I swear, all quiet is sweeping. Avatar, okay. Okay, Babylon. Elvis, okay. Hmm, okay. Hmm. 
Okay. 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 Tar. Okay. Yep. Mm hmm. Yep. You knew that was coming. Man, if Top Gun Maverick don't get this, it or the Batman. Okay. Wow, never heard this movie. Oh, Elvis, okay. Oh, hold up. What? Okay, um. Why in the hell Top Gun Maverick and the Batman did not make the cut? Excuse me, Oscars. Excuse me. I beg your pardon. I beg your pardon. I beg your pardon. What? Okay, okay. That that has to be the biggest snub I've seen so far. Seriously, man. Come on. Top Gun and the Batman both deserve this nomination list. Honestly, wow. I I'll talk more of it after this. And now visual okay, visual effects. Okay. I know it's going to be the cut, obviously. The yeah, okay, the Batman. Okay, cool. Black Panther. Mm -hmm. Tiger Maverick. Batman. Yep. Oh, boy. Here we go. Yep. Elvis, yes. Phenomenal is Elvis, by the way. Okay, Colin Farrell. Okay. Which, by the way, this is his first Austin nomination in his career. Hell of a career, man. He had a hell of a year last year. Brendan Fraser. Fraser. First Austin nomination, too. Mm. Okay. I never heard this movie, by the way. Mm, Bill Nye. Okay. Actress. Okay, Kate Blanchett. Her performance is really good. Oh, wow, okay. She made the cut for the first time. Nice. Hmm. Oh, which, by the way, I did this some research yesterday that Andrew Risborough, a lot of people were campaigning her, her performance to the movie to Leslie, which I never heard of. So we're not see yo see yo she got recognition. And Anya Armas, wow, okay, her first Austin nomination. The her performance is really good, even though the movie itself her was pretty damn bad. So I know it's on Netflix, but I heard the movie was pretty damn bad. Okay. And okay, nice, nice, not surprising there. Oh, by the way, I know a lot of people are pissed off about Viola Davis, they made the cut, and they yelled their Wilder for Till. They get nominated, so a lot of people are pissed off about that, I know. Okay, right. Okay. Yeah, if they ever were. Mm hmm. Steven Spielberg. Favorite Obviously, Spielberg, so. Todd Field. Okay. And Ruben Okay. Oh, boy. Here we go. Ten nominees. Oh boy, here we go. Okay, not surprising there. Yep, not surprising. Okay. Not surprising. Not surprising. Oh, it was, yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. And also, by the way, 
did the Russo brothers produce this movie? So how come they ain't made the cut? They ain't in the list. That's weird because I know Joe and Anthony Russo produce this movie as well. So it's kind of weird they made the cut. It's pretty damn weird. Hey, man. Hey, man. Hey, man. Not surprising. I'm glad. So glad I made the cut. But still, not surprising. Yeah, hell yeah. Okay. Also, which, by the way, for Top Gun Maverick is the first ever nomination for Jerry Bruckheimer. The first ever. This guy has produced movies since the freaking 80s. The 80s. He never got Austin on there. So, congrats to him and um, Tom Cruise again, that Oscar nod too for the. Um, Producer, I know Christopher Corey got the uh, got a win for the Usual Suspects screenplay, but yeah, man, really, let's see, really, let's see that. We're talking. Okay. Nice. 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 All right. Some pretty legit ones. Oh wow. So um, very nice. Very nice, y'all. Very freaking nice. Oh man. Um, hell, hell of a freaking um nomination list, man, y'all. So um, yeah, that was the. 95th Austin nominations announcement. Man, I'm so glad I got a chance to do it like this. This is actually the first time I have did, did like record like this for PC screen because I want to go ahead and just get over it to watch the videos. So I have to wait for like 10, 20 minutes to do the video download. So I want to go ahead and do it like this. I kind of will be doing this if it's like long videos, but it's like 25 minutes, but still, um, 12, 25 minutes. But yeah, if it's a long video, I'm going to do, I'm going to record for PC screen. So I kind of like this style so far. So yeah. Overall, pretty solid. Pretty solid announcement. So, oh, man. Damn. Pretty solid. So, yes, there man. you have it, Hot Squad. That was my reaction to the 95th Oscar nominations. So, we got some big surprises and snubs to a little talk about for a little bit. Really, I got to go for the snubs. I say Top Gun Maverick and the Batman should have definitely would have bad the best cinematography nomination. I don't know how in the world they skipped that out. Like, come on. For Top Gun Maverick. The freaking jet scenes, man. The freaking jet scenes. Holy crap. They were they were a hell of a spirit seeing this in theaters. I saw this actually twice. I saw it when it first came out. And the second time I saw it on Paramount Plus, like, the beginning this year. And the freaking jet scenes, man. God almighty, man. It feels so realistic. I'm like, why y'all do that? Why y'all skipped out Tucker Maverick as a cinematography? And for the Batman, same thing. I saw it twice. I saw it in theaters when it first came out. And I saw it at HBO Max. And the freaking, the freaking cinematography, the gorgeous shots. The freaking Batmobile chase scene, man. I mean, jeez, man. That's that's crazy, man. But yeah, all the other snubs I said in the other um other snubs I talked about in the reaction itself. I know a lot of people are pretty pissed off that certain, you know, um certain actors actors, actresses, you know, for Val Davis, Daniel Del Wilder. Oh, I'm trying to find out. Yeah. Those two particularly that I think so that I think it is, got really like snubbed, got completely snubbed. For the, you know, for the Oscars, because, you know, I'm guessing the Oscars definitely overlook. You know, the Oscars is, they overlook performances. They do that crap. They do that crap. And the biggest surprise for me, honestly, was actually talking about Maverick give best that screenplay. I did not expect that at all. Who who would really expect that at all, man? Because even though the screenplay writing is really good, but wow, it hit the Oscar back. So, yeah, and Brian Ty Henry, man, congrats to him. You know, ever since Paperboy, he's been my favorite actors right now. But the dude's got freaking range. The dude's got range, so... We're going to see he actually, you know, got the Oscar nomination. So, Hot Squad, that's going to be it for my reaction, my conclusion of the 95th Oscar nomination announcements. If you notice my voice, I just a little hoarse right now because, you know, I was just not feeling a little too good, you know, since yesterday or so. So, but overall, I'm still standing strong, obviously. It's just maybe a little cold, whatever. But, hey, look, I'm doing reactions for y'all today. 
And also, I have a chart live coming up next, which I'm very excited to do. First one in the year, and the first one I haven't done in a while. So, Hot Squad, if you enjoy reaction of the 95th Oscar nomination announcement, please hit that, hit that like button. Comment, subscribe, share your thoughts. What did you think was the biggest snub and surprises? And what was your favorite movie of the um of the last year? Excuse me, of last year. And who do you think is going to get the best picture nod? The win, actually. So, Hot Squad, please stay tuned because I have my first Trying to Life reaction of the year. It's going to be a surprise, so please stay tuned.